In today's Madden 21 video, I'm going to show you how to beat the press meta that I think is going to start to pop up, especially against gun spread, which I believe is the best offense in Madden 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. Now, if you've never been to my channel before, my channel is designed to help you take your Madden game to the next level through daily tips and tricks. We post four tips and tricks videos every single day on, on our YouTube channel right here. Um, talking Madden 21, different defenses, different route combinations that you can use, um, different blitzes that you can use, different coverage schemes, different running plays. And so if you are interested in getting better at Madden, I would highly encourage you to click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of the screen. All right, guys, we're going to talk about um, a special play that I really like out of the gun spread Y flex formation, and that is the h shallow cross now you want to put your best route run in here for the for the uh bucks that might be antonio brown it might be chris godwin i actually will typically be running this with antonio brown chris godwin will be right here evans will be right here and gronk of course will be right here now the play is h shallow cross like i said so you're just going to come out in this and this is going to beat a lot of defenses one of the defenses that it's going to beat the best though is the press coverage a lot of people i guarantee you you want to be on the right hash when you run this but what you'll see is um this press coverage meta, I think, will start to pop up. And the reason is because it can delay the routes for long enough that you're going to be able to hit something deep over the seams. So all we're going to do on this play is we're going to take the left of screen outside wide receiver and we're going to place him on a curl route. Uh, I like curl routes. You could also place him on a smoke screen, but I like curl, curl routes. It will basically turn this running back and Mike Evans into a curl flat concept. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Antonio Brown and I'm going to put him on a smart route. So I'm going to smart route his route. I'm going to take Gronk and I'm going to put him on, I typically put him on a curl route just as a check down on that left side. And then I'm just going to motion Antonio Brown to the left and snap it as he's in motion. What you'll see is this prevents him from getting jammed. They get a little natural pick and rub. And against that press coverage, you're going to be able to hit Antonio Brown with a hard left pass lead to the left side of the field. Now this is a very very consistent route, and like I said, if you have like a you know if you have your you want this to be your best route runner running this route, you don't want this to be you know Gronkowski. I would I wouldn't want someone like that. But what I would like is Scotty Miller. Now even if the safety is over top here, what you'll see is he's going to get that natural pick, that natural rub of the defense, and he's going to beat it to the outside. I would recommend also having a pass lead elite type of quarterback like a. Aaron Rodgers and regs. This works really well with him and Devontae Adams. Um, this also works really well with Tom Brady because he has the pass lead elite ability so that you can get the ball out to the outside of the formation. Now, I want to show you two other things that they're going to do. This is a man to man killer. It's a little constraint theory play. It's a play that I'll use, um, you know, just kind of, you know, if they're, if they're really doing a lot of man to man against me, this is a route that I will use. It's one of the best routes in the game to beat man to man. But hard left pass lead, get it out there, and you see you're going to get that nice animation against that man coverage. Now, let's say that they are running more of a shaded coverage. Shaded coverage outside, shaded coverage over top. And they're taking their two safeties on the outside, and they're doing something like this right here. This is a very popular coverage. Now, this deep blue, if you were just to run this play stock, this route would kind of have some trouble getting over the deep blue. However, whenever you run it like this, and you motion him to the left side of the screen... What's going to happen is he's now going to be going to the outside of the screen. He's going to beat this cover two man right over top. So it's just a lob ball streak, and you'll see this thing is going to torch that man in the coverage. I mean, it beat it by about five yards to the outside. Most people aren't going to expect this, and to be quite honest with you, most people are not going to use her this, at least the first time you run it. Now, you know, the second time, the third time you run it, and that's why it's important to mix in some constraint theory, you know, routes off of it so that they can't just, you know, lock it on this play from the Arizona Cardinals playbook. But if you have not already gotten my offensive guide on this, um, it's got over 125 pages of material on this playbook, breaks down every single formation and breaks down everything that you can possibly do from this playbook um, to really just torch pretty much any pass defense that someone's going to have. You see this route just literally torches man-to-man. -to -man. And that's shaded coverage outside and shaded coverage over top. So they're going to have to, you know, the best thing that they could do probably is a man-up three deep type of strategy. The problem with that is now your curl routes should be wide open underneath. But you're still going to have this route to Antonio Brown. Again, he's going to get out to the outside. 
get that little natural pick natural rub passing that hard to the outside and you see you're going to get that nice little outside shoulder uh, catch animation this is a phenomenal phenomenal play um, that you really need to consider adding to your arsenal now you can still run this in the middle of the field um, you'll see here he does beat man to the middle of the field as you can see right there he just doesn't beat it as badly when you run the motion it's going to allow him to completely obliterate man-to-man -man coverage now you can leave the streak on i will show you that real quick the only problem with that streak is if the streak gets pressed he kind of gets in the way a little bit and you see that that corner can kind of play it so if they're running a lot of press i would pre recommend um i would recommend running running him on a curl but if they're running zone you can easily run this route combination right here and this basically turns into a left side flood and you'll see right here, um, you see Antonio Brown is able to get that separation. And you can do this against all sorts of different coverages. But anyways, guys, like I said, the Arizona Cardinals offensive ebook is really, really, really good. It's got over 125 pages of material, over 10 hours of breakdown footage, showing you multiple film study videos, um, showing you how to run the gun two back, showing you how to run the five wide out of this, showing you how to run the spread, the trips, the cluster, all of it. So if you want to get better on offense, I would highly encourage you to pick up that guide. Now, what's really cool about this play, real quick before I jump off here, this little route to the running back, I, I cannot tell you how many times I've completed this route. It beats man and zone coverage. Here's why. It's an inside flat route. It's basically going to be ran uh, kind of like a drag route. But what you'll see here is I'm going to shade coverage underneath. So I got hard flats on the field and I got vertical hooks on the field shaded underneath. And what you'll see is this thing's still going to be able to be complete for about two to three yards. So it's one of the best routes in Madden NFL 21. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Make sure to pick up the guide if you haven't. That link is in the description. If you have any questions about this play or any questions about Madden that I can help you with, I'd highly encourage you to text me. Completely free to do that and to join our text message membership. We release weekly videos in there that are a little bit deeper, in, more in depth. Um, we release a one-hour bunch guide to the, our members. We released a two-hour Big Nickel Over G defensive guide to our members. And we released a Minnesota Vikings ebook or e-guide, e e basically. And then we also released a gun cluster guide. So I want to thank you so much for watching today's video. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Make sure to pick up that Arizona guide. I'm telling you, you won't be disappointed. We've taken people who basically were not able to pass for more than 100 yards a game, and we've turned them into 400 yards per game passers in Madden NFL 21. So be sure to pick up that guide. Thank you so much for your support. I appreciate it, and we'll see you on our next video at 6 o'clock, or we'll see you on our live stream tonight at 10 o'clock. And last but not least, be sure to check out some of our latest videos on the screen.